Hi guys and welcome back to Creative Glam. Today I'm getting it all done. I have a list of things that I'm going to accomplish today. Unload the dishwasher, vacuum, do some laundry, mop the kitchen. I have a dentist appointment. On my way back in I'll swing by the grocery store and pick up some groceries, do a dinner prep, and edit a video. So let's get started. I don't know about you all, but I find myself having to tidy my house every day. So my updated cleaning routine has me doing just that, cleaning high traffic areas in my home every day. This way I only have to deep clean once or twice a week. As you saw my list earlier of the things that I plan to accomplish today, I'm going to start unloading the dishwasher. I didn't have a lot of dishes to offload today, nor do I have a lot of dishes in the sink, so that's a good thing. But I won't start the dishwasher until it's a little more full. and try not to forget to change the sign from clean to dirty. After I finish the dishes, I usually try and wipe out the sink and wipe off the countertops. I just used a little Dawn here to clean the sink and to wipe off the countertops. I usually use Mrs. Myers, but I was currently out of it. I'll pick some up today. done with the dishes and because I do this every day it doesn't take long to tidy up the kitchen and as we all like to do once we complete a room light that candle <laughs> And especially since I didn't have my Mrs. Myers to wipe down the sink and the countertops, I'm going to light a candle. And so here, I'm gonna vacuum. It doesn't take very long. I usually do each level. I have three different levels in my home, so I try and do a level a day. That way I don't have to take that vacuum cleaner up three different flights of stairs. Today is the main level. I am loved by the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, he is mindful, he is mindful. 
on to the laundry room. It's time to do laundry. I saw these decals on Pinterest. I thought they were so pretty. So I ordered a set off of Etsy. So they came in and I'm going to add them to the front of the washer and dryer. And they were super easy to put on. I'll leave the link to my laundry room makeover down below in the description box. Now it's time to start some laundry. I usually do laundry about once a week um, and I usually have about five to six loads to do. Sometimes I'll do an extra load if I need to. Hey guys, let's connect on social media on Instagram and Pinterest at Creative Glam One. I'm gonna leave additional photos to this video over there. Stop by and check me out and make sure you follow. Sometimes I'll do an extra load during the week if I need to. Once the laundry's done, I take it and throw it all on my bed and I sort it. Shaking it as I go to make sure I get my socks back. <laughs> Once I've sorted it, then I fold all the items before I put them away. And here I went back downstairs into the kitchen and I mopped the floor. I just figured that I'd get all this done because, uh, before I go to my dentist appointment. I'm just going to get a cleaning um, so it's nothing major. I can still go ahead and pick up groceries after the dentist without any discomfort. Okay, off to the dentist. Time to get my teeth cleaned. So I'm back at home, guys. I picked up some Sharpies because I ran out of them. Um, they have completely dried up so I needed new ones I also needed dry erase markers but they didn't have those so I'll probably more than likely have to go over to Walmart and pick those up and then I got our favorite creamers uh, caramel macchiato caramel latte which is my favorite and hazelnut which is my husband's favorite I picked up some super stuffed uh, some extra large taco shells um, I'm doing taco Tuesday tomorrow yeah, I'm doing Taco Tuesday tomorrow, and I do want a couple hard shell. I usually make my taco shells um, out of 
fresh corn tortillas. I usually fry those up myself. Uh, but this time I think I'm going to use these and I'm also going to do soft tacos like street tacos too because I do have some uh, fresh shells to make street tacos. So some will be street tacos which are soft corn shells and some will be the um, preformed crispy taco shells. I got some Ziploc bags uh, for food storage. These down here are the gallon bags and these here are the sandwich size bags. They're a little bigger than the sandwich size bags um, and I like those. So if I cut a lemon to make tea at night, I usually can drop the remainder in here and um, save it. I got some cheese, some extra uh, sharp Sargento cheese. Um, I got some Oreo cookies for my husband. You'll see a lot of snacks here today because I was re-upping on snacks more than anything, uh, drinks and snack uh, food haul. And I guess that's what I'll call it. It's a predominantly food and snack haul. Some of it is, is snacks, some is for lunch, uh, and some is for dinner, and then drinks. Um, and then here I've got some sweet and salty granola bars, the peanut kind. I got some Coffee Cake Juniors. That's something else that my husband enjoys. And my children like them too. I, I'm not a big fan of them. The Intamins. I do like those. I do like the Intamin um, Coffee Cake. I think those are good um, with a cup of coffee. So I like those. Then I got some cereal. I got some Captain Crunch. And I got some Frosted Flakes. Those are like staple items in our home. I got the family size of the Frosted Flakes because they go through them pretty quickly. I got some 2% organic milk. I usually grab whatever is there. I'm not married to any particular brand, just so long as it's organic and 2%. I got some breakfast juice, passion fruit. This one here is our favorite. Been drinking that for quite some time. Um, got some drinks back here. Got some root beer. I can do A&W. I can do mugs. I, it doesn't matter. Um, I like this brand. I also like sarsaparilla, but root beer. Um, what else do we have back here? We have some cherry Pepsi. I don't drink cherry Pepsi a lot, but uh, occasionally when I'm having a heavy meal, I'll sometimes like if I'm doing a steak and potato kind of meal or a roast and potato kind of meal, for some reason I like Pepsi. And it may have to do with it was my mom's favorite drink. So therefore it kind of takes me back. If you're doing a, a pot roast in the microwave with all the, I mean the microwave, a pot roast in the crock pot with all the trimmings with the carrots and onions and everything in it, kind of a heavy type meal. Um, I tend to want a glass of cherry Pepsi. That was my mother's favorite drink. <laughs> Uh, Sprite. That's pretty much what we do now if we want a carbonated drink. If you're not looking for carbonated water but you do want something sweet and carbonated, Sprite is usually our go-to. I got some mango cranberry. I love mango cranberry. It's, it's one of my favorite. I like to mix my mango cranberry with my Sprite. It's very good. If you haven't tried that mix, give it a try. Let me know how you like it. And I got some Simply Lemonade. I love the strawberry. We go through that quite a bit because we mix the strawberry lemonade with the extra sweet pure leaf tea. This is another mix that we use quite often. If you haven't had it, give it a try. It's really good. Um, I also picked up some paper plates. I just picked up some store brand paper plates. Nothing in particular, just adding to. I wasn't out. I was just adding some in. At least I don't think I was out. I'm close. I was close to being out, but I'm not completely out. So I got some paper plates. I got some enchilada sauce because I use that when I make my Spanish rice on Taco Tuesday. I got some four cheese pasta sauce. This is actually just kind of going to go, this is actually going to go into my pantry. I prefer Dave's organic pasta sauce, but I have been trying to grab additional pasta sauces and put them away because you just don't know what's going to happen this fall. And if there's going to be some sort of a shortage, I don't know. I'm just trying to make sure my pantry is stocked up. Um, I got some Fabuloso. I use that quite a bit. I use it in my cleaning and in my laundry. I got some Unstoppables because I just used the rest of those. This um, I just used all that I had. Can you focus? I just used all that I had, so I just re-upped on those. I got some um, steel mesh scrubbers. I'm looking for the kind that don't um, that don't rust because I they rust on me and it drives me insane. 
Um, so I'm changing them often, often, because the minute they look like they're about to, to rust, I get rid of them. <laughs> and then I got some movie candy, um, movies for at home, our Netflix snacks. I got some Whoppers, which are my husband's favorite. And I got some Mike and Ike's, which are my favorite. I also got him some fudge stripes. I don't particularly eat cookies that way. I'm a candy girl. I like Noun Leaders and Mike and Ike's. Uh, he likes Whoppers and cookies. And fudge stripes is one of the cookies that he likes. Um, then I got some coffee. I picked up some coffee. I got some caribou, a medium roast. And I also got the original uh, Dunkin' Donuts. Uh, the original Dunkin' Donuts um, in K-Cups. I picked up just some something to have on the counter for uh, people to eat as they're coming through in and out and moving about their day. I grabbed some mild chicken wings and then I grabbed a couple uh, microwave dinners, store microwave dinners for lunch. I got a mac and cheese with blackened chicken and I got a grilled salmon with edamame, wild rice and broccoli. Um, I also picked up a turkey sub. It's already complete. I think I'm going to have some of this today. I'm going to cut a piece for myself and leave the rest for whomever. <laughs> and I got some bread. And I picked up a package of ground beef for the tacos that I'm going to make. I also picked up uh, some sour cream and onion lace potato chips and some Cool Ranch Doritos. Uh, those I felt would go really well with the deli sandwich. I thought that that turkey deli sandwich uh, would be really good with some chips. I also picked up some candy for my candy dish. Almond Joys, which I like. And then I got some Hershey Kisses with almonds, which I think everybody likes. And then I picked up um, a mixed bag of candy, of the minis. So I'll put those in the candy dish. And again, you can grab yourself a piece of candy and move on about your way. So that's pretty much it. As I said, it wasn't so much groceries as it was uh, snacks and drinks. So now I'm going to put these groceries away and have some lunch. So here I am editing the video you are currently watching. I am just about done. I will then export this video and upload it to YouTube. I hope you enjoyed my clean with me and getting it all done. I hope I was able to give you a little inspiration in getting your list done. If you enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more videos like this, leave me a comment below and let me know. I'd also appreciate it if you gave me a thumbs up. And don't forget to click one of the video links at the end of this video to see more home decor. Have a blessed day and I'll see you right back here next time on Creative Glam. Bye!